Joe's Baba Talent Workshop, FTD, WU, a subsidiary of Premium Academy, comes up with the 2024-2025 academic session of various categories of filmmaking and purpose discovery courses. The FTW over the years has been a formidable platform built by God for the advancement of his cause here on earth. This year's edition will be offering basic, advanced, and professional diploma programs in faith-based filmmaking. Come and have a date with your maker as participants do at the powerful encounter clinics and prayer quakes. The workshop is also open to children of ages 10 and above. Hurry now and enroll for the first semester of this session. Hold it between April 6 and 14, 2024. Cost fee at the entry level, which is for basic certificate, is 30,000 naira only. Children's cost fee is 15,000 naira only. This covers for tuition, accommodation, and the cost pack. Food is available for sale on campus at affordable price. Then you is LaSalle College, Haribabola, Ondo City, Ondo State, Nigeria. Yeah. Students can come with laptops, cameras, and other filmmaking gadgets if available for group projects. For more inquiry, call 0706440150 and 0816847 They have to W. We are not a mistake in this cosmos. You're welcome to another season of Encounter for the next 10 Sundays and the next 10 Fridays. Listen to the following prophetic instructions and be intentional about them. Number one, please do well to watch every part of every video. Do not forward any part. Every part needs to be viewed. Number two, each Friday that comes after the Sunday you are watching this video now will be a video dedicated to the EU's discussed in the movie. The VG will take place between 12 a.m. and 1 a.m. Nigerian time, middle of the night. We advise you not to pray the prayers in the day. We advise you to join the VG live. We advise you not to sleep and then wake up and then join the VG. It's an instruction from God. You don't pray this kind of prayers in the day. You pray them in the night where you can begin to see effect right here and now. So please do not miss any VG online every Friday on this YouTube channel. Number three, each of the parts will begin with a three minutes worship section. Please, partake in the worship section. The worship section was an intentional instruction by the Spirit of God to open up the portal for your deliverance. Do not just keep the song and say it's getting too long. No. Partake in the worship section, sing all the songs, let your mind be lifted. You can pray in tongues as you sing while you go into the movie. This is not the normal movie you watch and say you are entertained. This is a deliverance clinic. And so please take these instructions to heart. Number four, do not forget the way of sacrifice. If you followed all the previous parts you've been watching, sacrifice against sacrifice is very key. And so listen to me. Part of the sacrifice is this. Subscribe to this channel, like this channel, and make sure you share this video. Make sure you do. Do you know why? If you are connected to a hotter and you are expecting to be delivered, you are expecting to be blessed, you are expecting for God to help you through this altar, you must be connected to the altar in the way you support in terms of subscribing, liking, and sharing. Many of you have this attitude of downloading the video on your phone and send it to people. We receive calls from them all over the world. They don't know us, they don't know our channel, they don't know we have other movies that we have produced. All they want to know is about the keeper, they don't know the source. Please, if you are going to recommend this film to people, let them know the source. Let them know where they can get it. Let them know where to get more. I'm not saying you should not download, but please try and stream online first, after which you can now download. But let people who you are telling about the movie know the ministry that produced it. Let them know the source where this movie is coming out. Through that, you are growing this platform to make other people to be blessed. So if you know you normally forget those things, do them right now. Share, like, and subscribe to this channel. Recommend this channel to people. Tell them how to get here. Finally, make sure you get a jotter and a pen to jot every prayer point and every revelation that comes from this movie. For churches who want to use this movie as a premiere or want to join with the videos live in their own church videos, please let your protocol officer be strategically positioned so that people don't get to injure themselves 
by the manifestation of power that they emit from this film. At the same time, don't forget that sacrificial giving tied with understanding is a way to open up the presence of God to your, to your cases. And so, as you are also praying and believing God, let there be a sacrificial giving, sacrificial sowing of seed with understanding. It's not a ritual. So that you can see that all these things work together prophetically for your good. You wonder how this brother saw this movie, how the brother may get to see this movie, all the inspiration behind this movie, look at the power behind it. It didn't come by just sitting down and doing nothing, it came by sacrificial giving to understand the sacrificial giving to anointings, to, 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 to men, to tap into revelation of God's mind. I pray that as you watch this movie, you shall be mightily blessed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you very much. Fire, 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 fire,
In a season of ancestral wickedness and time of altars, the destiny of great families rests on the shoulders of Christ's redemptive power through a young priest. His name, Brajan. His people perish for lack of understanding. He is only permitted to play his part, not all the parts. Oh, you mean the Savior? Yes. They have been able to get deliverance according to the measure of revelation given to them, but not all. There are still some ordinances left unveiled. Huh. When some legals by dynasty standing, it means that their deliverance is incomplete. They have deliverance, but not a complete one, my kid. We work with demons. So we introduce the system of demonology. We are cast out. We go for a while and then come back reinforced. And according to what is written in their book, the book of Matthew chapter 12 verse 45, that when a demon is being casted out, that demon will come back with more seven powerful demons to come and inhabit their former habitation. <laughs> and the last state of that man is worse than the first. Mm. Even so shall it be unto this weaker generation. Mm. <laughs> My keeper, we are not done with the family of feeling. Let us switch over to the bloodline altar. Philip is now delivered from paternal altars. Mm. But his father is not. And his mother's family has a lot of voices and sacrifices. Then, we shall open the book of revenge and connect with his mother's family and pick over from there, my keeper. So be it! It is trouble. But is this how we are meant to live our life as Christians? Trouble day in and day out. That's my thought too. 
I've been having a lot of fearful dreams recently. Hmm. Be happy that you have dreams, so. Because one of the major reasons why people have attacks is because their dream life is attacked. You see, once your dream life is attacked, your life also is under attack. This particular one looks like it has a lot of information in it. No, it has no information but revelation. Don't forget, Philip, that uh, no revelation, no result. Mm, that's true, that's true. Uh, remember, information is physical and can be gotten from the street. While revelation is spiritual and can only be gotten from the spiritual realm. Three things are cogent. Um, the reinforcement of demons, maternal altars, and incomplete deliverance. Mm. You see, these people are stubborn, so we have to be stubborn. But I I'm repeating it. I said, is this how we must live our life as Christians? See, when unbelievers are just living their life freely without any battle, what is our offense? We committed an offense this day we give our life to Christ. The day we give our life to Christ, we turn our backs towards the devil, towards the flesh, and towards Satan and demons. And immediately, an attack was launched. The very day we gave our life to Christ, a war was declared upon our lives. But the Bible says there is therefore now no condemnation to those who are in Christ Jesus. It is no condemnation, not no battle, not no war. Onward Christian soldiers, Marching us to war, looking unto Jesus, who is gone before. Christ the royal master, lead against the foe, forwarding to battle, see his banner go. Pa -na 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 -na. Oh, what Christian soldiers marching us to war, looking unto Jesus, who is gone before. Mm -hmm. So we face a focus on Jesus, and the war will be won. Mm -hmm. This victory, we shall fight for it. We don't fight for victory, we fight in victory. Because the atmosphere of victory has been created for us. So we are only fighting in the atmosphere of victory. That is it. Yeah. What happened to your father? Oh. Your boss said he has been calling you severally, but you refused to pick the call. Eleven missed calls. My <laughs> phone has been on silence. <laughs> he needs you urgently. I think there is a little problem. I will call him, there's no problem. Uh, Philip, it means we will continue our discussion later. All right. Mm. All right. Ah, my brother, I'm tired. I don't know what to think again. My life is just so long. My wife lost the pregnancy again yesterday. What? Yes. I hope it's not due to much stress because I understand that stress can cause miscarriage at times. This is not about stress. Not at all. It's a dream. It's a dream again. The dream of someone tying rope on a stomach. Uh, see, I, I don't know what to think. Okay? If everything stopped after the prayer session and deliverance sessions. What? Well, I suddenly didn't think just showed up yesterday night and. Pregnancy gone again. The devil is a bastard. A very, very big bastard. But how you about the company, sir? Well, the company is okay, moving on economically. And um, the member of staff too is um, improving. At least we have those that are older than 30 now. So mm. things are moving on better. In that case, we must seek for spiritual intelligence to know why this um, case of your wife keeps recurring. Um, you know what? Mm -hmm. I think I know why. You know why? Uh, okay, let's 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 hear it. What is it? I'm sure it's because I'm here to fulfill my promise 
of a furnished landed property that I ought to have given to you? No, sir. I don't think so. You see, as much as it is very important to offer sacrifice on God's altar, mm -hmm. like Noah, um, David, and so on, it is not the major key to deliverance. I told you. Yes, yes, you mentioned it. But you remember you told us this being our first is very important. Yeah, but then you see there are five keys, five major keys to you know, securing deliverance. Okay. Number one is you offering yourself. You are the first sacrifice. You offer yourself as a sacrifice according to Romans chapter 12, verse 1. Then secondly, you know, offer presence uh, of worship in his presence, Hebrew, uh, according to Hebrews 13, 15. At the same time, you know, another thing is giving. Giving, you know, out of understanding. Giving with understanding, not out of emotion or empathy. Mm -hmm. You know, they at the same time, even if you are donating, you are donating out of a leading, not out of emotion or, you know, wanting to do this. Mm -hmm. Then the final one is the decrease, the prophetic decrease. Mm -hmm. And we have a prophetic dimension of deliverance that can actually be administered to people. Mm -hmm. So you see that, you know, giving or leaving things out is not just the only key. That's, that's very correct. Because we had a leading mm. that we need to give that to you so that we can see God's face. Mm. I'm telling you. I believe God will help you and um, it will help you. At the same time, I think I also need to seek guidance mm. on this issue. Thank you. Thank you. I'm sorry. I'm really running late. My oh. wife is still at the clinic. I need to go and I don't want this rain to catch up with oh, me, if you right. don't mind. No, I don't so mind. I can just Thank get ready. No, Thank, no. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. So what did John say about um, the dream? We haven't really had time to discuss. But some really, the deliverance of this family is not yet to complete. Although personal deliverance has been achieved. But bloodline deliverance is still needed. Ah, bloodline again. Ah, I'm, I'm fed up of this, of, of all see, these things. Are. that's what the devil wants to achieve. To make us fed up of the whole situation and lose our faith and confidence in God. And it's very risky. It's very risky for you, sir. Me? For me? No, I, I don't think so. I don't think so. Why me? Because you are the target. You are also a first son. For me, the altar of sickness and conversion is over. And that means it's over for me. Maybe you are my son. Dad, victory is not generic in this kingdom. You have to fight for your own victory. The victory of the man of God does not automatically transfer to his children. We are yeah. individual fighters. Oh God, what else do they want? What else do they want? Baba Kintewe has come here. He has asked for forgiveness and salvation. That Baba Kintewe is not the keeper of the altar. He was only loyal to the pattern that has existed before he was born. Hey, Philippe. Philippe. Let, let's try this. Yeah? Um, you will see that if your friends can leave, there will be peace. Let's try it. This time around, I will allow you. In fact, they will soon be leaving. They will soon be leaving. <sighs> soon be leaving. Bloodline. Bloodline again. Really, I, it's, it's difficult to believe this explanation because mental manager told me it was all right before he discharged him. <laughs> He's not better at all. I mean, the last time I saw him on the street, I wept for him. This case was so serious. This... He, was, he was going naked due to this madness. It was so sad. This is so serious. <sighs> this is so serious. See, okay, do you know any of his relatives or his place or his people? Mm, I actually know of a family member of his. Okay. You know, he was staying with this person before we got our own space, when we were running the fraud and Yahoo business. Uh, yeah. No problem, I'll just have to tell Bro John. Mm. Then I'll have to see the mental manager also. He said he has some discussions with me. After then, I will revert to you. I pray the Lord will help us. Man, man, see, it, this, it's, this it's very so sad. Serious. This is serious. It's calm. Mm. So sad. Mm. Do you still think it is right to give Bro John that house on the land we both know as a problem? <sighs> That is more reason why we need to give it to them. You know, they are prayerful, they are spiritual. They will to handle whatever is in that place, okay? Then it is better we let them know so that they can be prepared. Well, 
That is the reason why we are giving it to them in the first place. If they move into that house, with their prayers and all their work, if there are many more things we are not thinking about, it will be resolved. Okay? Well, I'm just thinking they should know. What if you say otherwise? Fine. I say so. As much as I want to help, I cannot. Because I'm no longer interested in this business anymore. Zeros was my last patient. Claire, how can we now help Scam? Because you told me it was alright then. I'm surprised. You know you are the only one that understands this spiritual thing. Maybe the covenants or the thing came back immediately after I left here. But you have to help me. You have to. This is not a psychiatric problem. But a serious spiritual one. All my efforts to take care of Zeros, the last time was the, it was a field. Not only you. You introduced a spiritual method. Mm, yes. <sighs> yes, but at least if you can help me to take him off the street first, then we can find what to do. On one condition. You don't even ask to have him calling you, Sis Oliver. I also have a problem in my family. See, I am 36. No relationship. My elder sister is 41, for crying out loud. Her husband is 45. No marriage. Are, are you serious? What, what is stopping all of you? No partners! As for me, this married woman that do come to me as their sugar daddy. A lot of break calls when they come. Everything will, will, will just start serious. But later will just go off like that. For no reason! Hello, we help us. Um, what do you want me to do about it now? Help me. Help me, bro, Jude. I have seen you exercise victory over zero. Tell your brother to help my family. You want to settle down for crying out loud. Uh, is that now the condition for helping scam? Yes. Because I have I have helped you in the past. I have. No problem. See, just help me with that of scam. Let me take him off the street first then I will know what to do with the help of God, all on God. Okay. How do I get the information of his will? Um, concerning that, Zeros will call you, meet with you, and he'll give you necessary details about it. No problem. No problem. Thank you. And what would you like to take? I see, this mood, I'm not taking anything. I, I just have... help me to do that. For I have please. chicken at all. Philip, so when is your mommy coming back? I would rather ask. What has she gone to do in the village for that long? Ah, I don't know. I don't know, ma. Oh, Brother John, is there any message from the realm of the spirit? I have an impression in my spirit. And that was why I asked you the question earlier about what she went to do in the village and when she would likely return. I don't know. <sighs> Except maybe she has gone to greet her parents. John, is there any problem? Matana alters and pattern. Hmm. This shark is loud and clear. Hmm. Any book of revenge. Any, any book, book of, of revenge. revenge. Opened up for me. Ah, opened up, opened for, up me. for me. Because of my matana sins. Being opened, opened because, because of my, my matana sins. I invoke the blood. I invoke the blood of Jesus. Of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Ah. Any matter now, you know, because of my sin, I invoke the blood of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, name we pray. Amen. Philip, you will need to ask your father some questions. Um, John, I sent for you. Yeah. Um, I was just thinking I've delayed for too long, so. Your house is ready. You can now move your things there. Ah, really? <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. It was uh, late last night I saw your message that you needed to see me. Yeah. I don't even know you still to share this wonderful news. Thank, Thank you, sir. But uh, we don't have things. We just have a few clothes. Just a few clothes and a few stuffs. We don't have much. <laughs> well, I don't think that should be a problem. But I hope your younger friend, um, Philip, 
I hope you'll be happy about the development. Uh, you'll be fine. You will. Okay, that's good. Thank you very much. I God bless your heart, sir. That's good. Wow. That's good. <laughs> I cannot be fine. I cannot be fine alone in this house. Bro, John. You are my sunshine. I cannot do without you. Leave this house and I will follow you. No, but Philip, your dad will be with you. And besides, God is here with you. How will I go? How? How will I learn more? Leave this house and I will follow you, please. But you can grow by the word of God. You have your Bible with you. And you have Holy Spirit. Even with all of that, I think we still need each other. Staying alone with my dad, who does not believe in spiritual things, is not okay for me. Iron sharpened iron. So a man sharpens the confidence of his friends. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Philip. Yes, mom. The company you keep determines what accompanies you. And um, see. I don't think this should be serious. If you tell your dad and he allows you, you can follow us. And if he doesn't, you can always visit us time to time. I'm hoping our place will not be far from this place. You see, I'll follow you. Please. No, not possible. You're not leaving this house. What are you thinking? I am thinking that living with them will better my spiritual life. I still need to grow. No, no, no. You've grown enough. You have, you have, you have grown enough. So you want to leave me alone in this house? But my mom will soon be back. Besides, I will always come to check up on you from time to time. And I promise you that you're not leaving this house. That is... No, 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 no. You're not leaving. And that's fair now. Just, just stay. Stay. No way. Not possible. That please... No way. Yabo, 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 please, Yabo, please, ah, Yabo, please, Yabo, Yabo, please, Yabo, 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 I don't know to go is your mom or Philip. That was ah, it. Calm down. They they give they give your mom canes. And they, they were asking her to be beating me. Ah, beat you? For what? Why? Why? Ah, ah. And I told her, I wonder, but she will not listen. Yeah. What is this? Ah! What is this? Ah! Wait, oh. huh. This is serious. So, did she come here to beat you physically or what? It's just of a dream. It's just of a dream. And I wonder, I wonder how, how I can I see it now? That's wait, oh. They beat you from the spiritual realm. 
and I can see it physically in this realm. Ah, 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 ah. This calls for a spiritual emergency. Ah. I, I think we should go to them, yeah? Go to Dad. This I can't, I can't. I can't eat anything from the dream, man. It's about show for second. Dad, where has mom gone to? Because I could see her in my dream. She was dancing around the masquerade. They began to pour blood on her body. They poured blood on her body? Yes. Jesus. Jesus. Philip. I don't think you're going to be surprised at all. Because you already saw in your revelation the keeper opening a book of revenge for your maternal family. <sighs> revenge. What is what is all this again? I, I thought Philip is free. No, I can tell you is free. Why why all this why, why all this revenge book of I don't understand. I think the devil has shifted to your wife's family. Uh, Philip already saw it. The devil is up to something. Hey, I said this. But Mike, I said this. I said if Philip eventually prays through, that doesn't mean it will automatically release you. I said this. But where exactly has Mama Philip come to? I keep asking him that question. Well, he hasn't answered me yet. You have to. Because all this revelation has something to do with the ancestry of your wife's family. She went for, for a festival. Actually, I told her not to go anymore because I don't want her to partake in it anymore. But, but she, she just wanted to go. Hey, let me ask, what did they do there? Well, they, they, they buy a goat. They kill it and then they use the blood to pray. Mm -hmm. And then they will see it to go to after everything. So I told her not to go again because she has been going since she was young. It's, it's, a, it's a normal thing they do in their family. Mm -hmm. You know, everybody comes back to the village, you know, from wherever they are. Mm -hmm. Now I see what they are trying to do. I see what the devil is holding on to. They are enforcing an altar and they are ratifying it by blood. Mm. Hmm. And this is to keep the altar alive. And it is binding. But she has been good since she was young. And she, since she has been going, I've not been experiencing any of these issues, these attacks or dreams or anything. Now, <laughs> the accuser has found a foothold to strike. Mm. The devil is very intelligent. He looks for loopholes in the life of people so that he can maintain his relevance in their families. Mm -hmm. That means there are many wrongs people are doing now. But the devil will ignore. Not until a point in time, he will use that loophole to strike. Sister Veronica. Joe. What am I to do? The same thing. The same thing you've been shining away from, which is prayer. Prayer. And this thing concerns you more because you are the husband. Only God knows the repercussion of all this beating you are receiving in your, in your dream. They are marks of bewitchment, stagnation, and impending troubles. And they have only come to register their relevance in this family. Ah, please, sir. <laughs> Please help me out. So that not to go. Follow me will I do this. Follow me will I keep fighting these battles. Ah. I need my total to be fast. Please help me. Let us pray. Every witchcraft power. Every, every witchcraft power. In my foundation. In my foundation. Bro, Mike, stop. Oh. Uh, this is the same problem that we always have. You don't want to open your mouth and pray. And that's why they are beating you. They will beat you again tomorrow. For how long you like you fighting? Shout this loud and clear. I shouted it the other time too. You will shout it again. We are shouters in this kingdom. We travel in Zion. 
every witchcraft power, every witchcraft power, attacking my foundation, attacking my foundation, every witchcraft power, every witchcraft power. In my foundation, in my foundation, attacking my destiny, attacking my destiny, crossed by fire, crossed by fire, every witchcraft power in my foundation, attacking my destiny, be crossed by fire in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. You are going to pray. Bewitchment of my mother's house. Bewitchment of my mother's house. Be roasted by fire. Be roasted by fire. Bewitchment of my mother's house. Be roasted by fire. In the name of Jesus. Bewitchment of my mother's house. Be roasted by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. For in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. For in Jesus' name we pray. I don't believe in all these um, religious things. I slung as I don't fight anybody. I read my Bible. I feed the poor. I'm safe. I'm free. Mm -hmm. Sir, if you are not really born again, I'm afraid all these prayers we've been praying for you, we have no effect. Uh -uh. Yes, because the first and major altar that passed Every other altar is the altar of sin and iniquity. Well, I'm not, I'm not committing anything. That's self righteousness, that. Because the Bible says, for all have sinned, and I come short the glory of the Lord. Exactly. It's very correct. Because you actually need a time that you will confess Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior. It is only then that you can be saved. And that is when you will truly be saved. I will work towards it, I promise. But why not now, Dad? I said I will work towards it as soon as possible. Jude, you're welcome. How did it go? That's good. I can see a slight bruise on your face. This other part of your face. What's the problem? Do you have a minor accident? Um, I, I'm ashamed of myself right now. Ah, ashamed of yourself? What happened? The evil spirit in that boy, it slapped me. It pounced on me. It beat me mercilessly today. If, if not because of, of those guys that saved me. What did you say to Scam? I, 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 I tried to cast it out in the name of Jesus, and immediately it went angry and went white. That's that's very strange. The name of Jesus is one of the sure weapons of victory. 
And in the mouth of the righteous is availed much. Ah, but what has happened? See, I can't see. I can't say. Ah, I just know I need to make some research because he kept mentioning one name. He kept mentioning one name like that. Oh, it mentioned the name. So, what? What name? What is the name? Ty, Ty, yeah. He, he said Prince of Tyros. Yeah, I remember. He said Prince of Tyros. He said he's Prince of Tyros. Prince of Tyros. That sits on the seat of the gods. Tyros. Ah, no wonder. Ah, uh, wait, how come? Who is he? Do you know him? Tyros is a system of wealth and riches. A very proud spirit that dwells in the children of destruction. It must have gone angry because you mentioned the name of Jesus. Really? Please, please tell me more. Oh, Tyrus. Sorry. He Thank is you. a very wise man. Even the Bible recorded that he is wiser than Daniel. He has been from the beginning. In fact, he was in the Garden of Eden. Tyrus. Uh, how then did Scam now encounter the spirit? This spirit is innocent. It is the lifestyle of men that cause them. Okay. You see, when people begin to look for wealth in a fraudulent way, okay. they are automatically calling the spirit of Tyros. The same thing when our young ladies begin to dress seductively, dressing anyhow half naked without moderation. They are automatically calling on this Jezebelic system in their lives. It is men that cause them. Hi. Uh, what then do we now do about it now? What are we going to do? Never mind. Never mind. Be patient. The yeah. next time, you have to be patient. Okay. So that you can know how to engage properly. Every spirit have their various rules of engagement. Sorry. Thank you. What did you do? Did you what have you have you used anything? No, it is. It's like we have some uh, first aid equipment in the trial. Actually, we just completed um, the building, four flats. You know, yeah, so we saw it outside. Yeah. So I'm just thinking this will be good as an apartment for you. And you can have neighbors in the other three. I hope it's okay. It's beautiful. And you're okay with the furnished place. It's, it's beautiful. beautiful. <laughs> See, ah, this is huge. It's not. May the Lord reward you, sir. Amen. Amen. <sighs> It even have television. Yes. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. This piece is beautiful. Mm -hmm. You see, and I pray that the understanding that you have that made you to sow this into our lives, that God will reward you in Jesus' name. Amen. The understanding that you have that will make that make you to sow this on God's altar. Mm -hmm. We attract His presence, Amen. and He's going to grant all your heart desires Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. Ah. And she said, and she go. We give God praise. So that's <laughs> very happy, sir. Because, you no, know, because of Philip, he said he will be coming to visit us. And this place is not too far from where we are currently living. Mm, yeah, Ooh. not really far. Just few few distance. Oh, that's yes. very good. That's very, very good. Nah, I'm happy. I'm the happy rooms that. are there. Yes, this way. What would you like to say? No, don't worry. Uh -huh. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> My keeper. Keeper of the sacrifice. Whatever that has brought you here must be a matter of urgency. Importantly urgent. While going through the list of those that God delivered from the altar. 
I found out another binding sacrifice for Veronica. Veronica? Yes. The widow? Mm. John's mother? Yes, my keeper. I found out that nobody among his father's children made any headway. It is as if they are hidden despite their academic qualification. Tell me more, I am interested, please. Let me keep this for now, my keeper, but initiate the power of grave and of the dead to connect her back to the altar. Her people have covenant with the grave. Hmm. Beautiful. <laughs> the spirit of the grave. The greatest swallower on earth. Yes, the keeper of the grave. Oh, so be it. Afro Mike. We really appreciate you for all the time we've spent here in your house since the death of my husband. Oh, you've been so helpful and we are so grateful. Thank you so much. God bless you, sir. Uh, and we thank God. Thank God. To God alone be all the glory. Hallelujah. And we are very sorry for whatever inconveniences you must have caused here and there oh. while we stayed with you. No, there are no inconveniences. No, 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 no. Really? They're just, they're just things to make us strong. Mm. Wow. Oh. Okay. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you for that, sir. So we are here to inform you that we are about to leave in. Ah. Yes, to our new location. It's time? Yeah. Yes, sir. Ah. Let me see. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for, for your time in my house. Your time in my house has, has, has brought so much joy, mm -hmm. so much peace, and we're so happy to have you. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. And thank you for the healing of my son. Ah, thank God for that. Ah. Roger. 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 Are you really leaving me behind? Ah, uh, Philip. My heart is with you. Hmm? Trust me. That's no cause for alarm. Philip, don't worry. I promise that. Um, Anytime you want to go and see them, um, you're free. Oh. I will not stop you. <laughs> you might be far to them. That has spoken. Okay. Philip, cheer up. Are you fine now? Rajan, you are an inspiration to the youth. I am blessed to have you. Mm. And I will protect this relationship with my life. Mm. Thanks for all you do. And I'm really happy to see how fast you are growing in God. Sincerely, it's a very big encouragement to me. And I can only pray that God will keep and preserve you. So thank you, sir. We need to go now. Oh, <laughs> and I regards to Mommy Philip when she returns. Philip, it's okay. We'll be fine. We'll be all right. Yeah. Philip, now. Nah. Thank you. Philip. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. Wife. I'm missing you. Yeah. I'm missing you, my love. Please come. You're welcome. Sit down. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you, my love. <laughs> yeah. mm. I'm so surprised and shocked to see you, but I'm happy to see you. Yeah, wonderful. See, wait. Let me get you something. To okay. 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 Let me get you something. That's my love.
Dear? Dear? Sincerely, I have missed that. If you see the way I hugged him in the dream, he looked more handsome and well fed. Mm. I'm afraid it's, it's rare. Why give her joy? Why must we pray again? Wait, is it not about that? That's not that you saw. That is not that you saw at all. That's a spirit thing we have been bringing it to pray. Really? Now, come to think of it, I have never seen him, not even in my dream for one, except for this. Jude, Mom, come to think of it. Why is that dream coming now? The devil is smart. Why is it now? And why is it during our first night in this house? Oh, John, you, you suspect a lot. This is not suspicion or discernment. Mm -hmm. You see, every serious Christian will have the Spirit of God in their life. Must not just suspect, but discern. The Holy Spirit must always you know, reveal the truth. What then do we pray about? We need to seek and uh, discover the means of engagement of this kind of spirit. What to do when we have this kind of dreams, the secrets of what to engage. You see, there is a great world of difference between the living and the dead. Is that? I think the noise is coming from the nest. The mother is holding the sun. <laughs> I think it's the other way around. The sun is holding the mother. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, oh. Well, we get to know that. If only men can study and not just read from the volume of the books. Ha! Ah. Jude! Jude! Ah. Krajan. Jude. Yeah. If you must indeed defeat the Prince of Tyros, okay. that is wrecking judgment on the children of disobedience. Okay. Then you might need to go and study Ezekiel chapter 28. Ezekiel 28. Mm -hmm. Okay. You see, his judgment, his systems, and his dooms are there. Hmm. Hmm. You must understand the communication of the Prince of Tyros if you must displease him. <sighs> oh. I'm beginning to understand things now. You see, when you want to defeat a demonic spirit, okay. it's not just going to pray. You must go and find out about their doom and their judgment. Mm -hmm. Then you remind them of it. Through that, you have weakened their hearts. Mm -hmm. 
um, Bro John, I will find time to study it. But at the same time, I would love us to have time to talk more about it. Of course we will. But you see now, I'm really praying and seeking for more revelations on the issue of this grief in yard spirit. Mm. And with what I'm finding out, Jude, it's alarming. <sighs> so alarming. Many people are enslaved at the gate of the grief without them mm. even knowing at all. Okay. The life of people are ensnared at the graveyard gate. Jesus. Some are dead already. Ah. Spirit of the grave! Gatekeeper of the grave! Good. My keeper, how may I be of service? Wow! of the grave. You caught people's destiny in short. You have power. You are cruel. You have victory. You have gates. You are a glutinous heater that never gets satisfied. I am ready to serve in full capacity, my giver. Good. Can I have access to some bodies? We have access to all the bodies that have been lowered beyond the ground. Dust, nation. God. <laughs> the keeper of the grave. I need the body of Daniel. Daniel Akiwali. She alamadamani sava. Lemano sava. <laughs> Sorry for disrupting your rest. We need you to bring a process back to existence. To continue a pattern. Please keep out of the grave. Dominate him. Enter into him and then enter the dream life of Veronica. Send me my keeper. <laughs> you may go. <laughs> Strolling around the city, looking for you, my love. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. I has not been so easy since the time you left. I actually came to restrain our relationship. And I hope you are okay with that. Oh, why not? Oh. I'm okay. <laughs> Good. I mean, let's walk down the street. <laughs> To see Bro John and his family urgently. Oh. Ah. That man is not a husband that died. Mm. Ah. Satan and deception. Kai. Ah, ah. Philip, where are you going? I told you I need to see my people urgently. The devil is on a dangerous project. Why are you carrying your bag? Are you not coming back tonight? Dad, it's a serious issue. We need to sit together, pray together, study together. We need to be there for some time, you know? We need to be together for a while. If you are not together with them, what about me? Eh? I've been having very scary dreams. Your mom has refused to pick my calls. I, I, I'm scared to stay alone in this house. Dad, be serious with God. I was once like you with a I don't care attitude. But when I see the harm the devil can do to a life outside Christ, I have to take my life serious with God. 
God is just talking about time. Am I not born again? You are a moralist, Dad. Confess God as your personal Lord and Savior. And when you do that, an altar is automatically being constructed for you in the Spirit. The name of this altar is called the Throne of Grace. <sighs> throne of Grace. Throne of Grace. Is that an altar? Yes, it's an altar where all Zionite comes to commune with the immortals of heaven. Anyone who has not registered with this altar is living on a time bomb. Dad, I need to run. Hey, wait, wait, Philip. Philip, don't be long. Because I need you to explain these things to me more. Dad, read Hebrew 4.16. I need to run. Hebrew 4.16. Hebrews. Hebrews 4, 16. Hey, I am. 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 H